Welcome to Pabli. In this video, you will learn how you can automatically create posts in medium.com directly and automatically from RSS feeds of any website. So guys, for setting up this automation, we are going to use RSS by Pabli feature of Pabli Connect inside the trigger step and open AI, which is a artificial intelligence based content generator in the action step. And after that, we are going to connect medium, which is an publishing platform for writers, right? So after that, whenever there is a new post in the website, in the RSS section of any website, according to the title or the topic of the post, article will be created and shared on medium.com automatically. And we are going to set up this automation without any coding very easily. Let me show you how. So we are using Pabli Connect to set up this automation, which is an automation tool. And this is the landing page of Pabli. And I have pasted the same link in the description as well. From here, you can set up your free Pabli Connect account and you will get free automation tasks every month to test and set up your automations. Okay. So you can just sign up right now from the given link. And after that, you have to sign in and you will reach the dashboard of Pabli Connect like this. Okay. And here you have to click on this create workflow button to set up the automation workflow. And here you can give a name to your workflows as well. So I'm giving the name here as RSS feeds RSS feeds to a medium.com or just medium, right? So after giving the name, just click on this create button and you can see your workflow page is ready here. And on this page, you will find the trigger and the action module. So with the help of these two things, we are going to set up any automation. So in the trigger guys, uh, we are going to connect the trigger application in which the trigger event is going to occur. So trigger event is that event which is going to kickstart this workflow and the action would be the response towards the trigger or the consequence of the trigger, right? So in this use case, uh, any new feed in the RSS section of any website is going to act as a trigger and the action would be to generate the article and share the article on medium, right? So here guys, I am going to search for a feature of Pabli Connect, which is called RSS by Pabli. Here it is selected. And in the trigger event, you have to select new item in feeds. All right, then click on connect. And here it is asking for the feed URL. So in this URL, you can paste the link of any RSS feed of any website. Right now I'm uh, under this website and let me select uh, the health RSS feed of this website. So I'm just going to copy the link of this health section of RSS and I'm going to paste it here in this feed URL like this. And as I'm going to click on save and send test request button, the most recent feed published on the website will be fetched here. So I have clicked here and you can see this is the response we have received and the title of the feed is this know your beer, a comprehensive guide to beer styles. Okay, let me show you the same here. Under the health section, the most latest feed is this know your beer and it got captured here, along with the publishing date along with the link and the content snippet and the whole content you can see. Okay. Now this is a small uh, RSS feed. And according to the title guys, according to this title, I want to generate a whole article that I want to share on medium. Okay. For that, we are using open AI application, which is an artificial intelligence based content generator. So I'm just going to search for open AI here in the section step. And the action event would be to generate the content Then click on connect from here, select add new connection. And here it is asking for the API key token of open AI application that you will find in the open AI key pages. So if you're logged in here like this, you can just directly go to the key pages and from here you can generate the key. Okay. These are the keys. Just cl click on generate key and a key will be generated. Copy that paste it here like this and then click on save and you will be connected. All right. And here it is asking for the AI model that you want to use. So this is the mostly used model. I'm just going to keep at keep it as it is. And here it is asking for the prompt. So prompt is a kind of command that you have to give to open AI to generate content for you. 
so you can learn about the commands or the prompts from this key concepts under the documentation section of OpenAI. You can learn how to give prompts. Right now, let me just show you that I want to uh, write an article. Okay, so I'm just going to type here as a prompt, write an article on. Okay, and after that, I'm going to map the title from this step this is the title okay for us and uh, for this title i want to create a article okay so i'm going to map this title here in the prompt write an article on after on i'm going to map this title okay so this will act as a prompt okay and here it is asking for the tokens so you can learn these technicalities from the open ai application itself i'm just putting down the token amount to as 400 the default value was 256 here you can select the sampling type okay the sampling value so you have to put the sampling value uh, between 0 to 1 default is point, uh, 0 0.7 i'm just putting 0 0.7 here okay so these are all some technical details that you can learn from OpenAI. Stop sequence. So uh, you have to provide a stop sequence to make the artificial intelligence know where to stop. Okay. Best of. So here you can set the best of possibilities. So if you want that uh, the OpenAI generate content for you and resample it and give you the best among three. Okay. Let's say you are selecting best of three. So it will give you the best result among the three results. Okay, so I'm selecting three here. Default value was one. Right now click on save and send test request and a fresh article original article will be generated according to your given prompt from open AI application. So it might take a few seconds. Let's see. Alright, so this is the response we have received guys you can see. The text is completed. This is the model used and here you can see in this choices zero text label. We have received this article, a comprehensive guide to beer styles. There are so many different type of beer available in the market today. And you know, LA stout, Porter, wheat beer, everything is here. A whole new article on the given title is here. Now we can share it on medium for that. Just click here on this plus icon and another action step will open up. From here, you can search for medium platform and the action event would be create a post Then click on connect from here, select add new connection. And here it is asking for the token or the API key of medium account. So you need to reach the settings and the security and app section there. You can generate a token from the integration section. So let me show you this is my medium platform and here let me go to the account settings under account settings we have security and apps option here when you scroll down you will find this integration token and this is already a token i have generated you can create a new token as well like this click on get token and this is a new token we got you can just have to copy it paste it here Okay, then click on save and you will be connected with medium like this. All right, and here it is asking for the post title, the format and the content. So I'm going to use the data that we have generated in the previous steps using open AI for the post title. I'm going to use the first step, the trigger step, the RSS by Pavli step where we have fetched the title from the RSS feed. Content would be HTML only. You can select as markdown as well. I'm selecting HTML. In the post content now, I'm going to map the content that we have generated using OpenAI. This is the text label and this is the content. I have mapped it. Canonical URL. So if you want to place any URL, you can place it here. If you want to place any tag, you can place it here. You can save this uh, uh, post as a draft or public or unlisted. I'm saving it as draft. And after reviewing that, I can publish it. Okay. Now click on save and send test request and you will find a new post in the draft section. Let me open the draft section of medium. Where are my drafts? So these are the drafts Four drafts I have. Let me click on save and send test request. This is the response we have received. Let's see in my draft section if we got a new draft post. And here you can see we got a new title know your beer comprehensive guide to beer styles. And when you open it, 
you will see the whole article like this. Okay, right? And this is the content that we have created, generated with the help of OpenAI. Okay, so this is how it is going to happen, guys. So our automation is working fine and you have to set up this automation only once. After that, you don't have to do anything manually in this workflow. After that, whenever there is a new feed in the health section or any other section of any RSS feed of any website, the, gen the content will be generated and will be shared and will be saved in the drafts or your, of your Medium account automatically. And guys, you can use this workflow as well as I'm going to paste the link of the same workflow in the description and you can clone it in your own free public connect account and start using this automation instantly. Guys, thank you so much for watching our video and please, please let us know how our automation ideas are helping you in the comment section. And if you have any queries related to this application, please ask your queries from this forum link and do check the pricing of this application from this link. And guys, we are open to ideas. If you want us that we should make videos on other aspects of your business, please do let us know in the comment section. And if you like our work, please subscribe to our channel.